Trying to get it out the mud Looking at me Trying to figure who I was Sort of with your I just want to feel the love I feel like it Cause I can't even trust my love Loyalty I say spoil me If I know for you keep Yo, yo, yo Q&A Q&A sesh Q&A sesh See what y'all working with tonight, bro. Friday night Q and A sesh. Uh, why does my lighting seem like terrible? Though? Get this better like that. Angles, my boy. Work for some people to get in here. What's good, Kareem? How you doing, man? I'm trying to see if some more people will come up in here. There should be some more people, but we'll see. Just give it some time. Because even the last time I went live, it took a minute. I got a video for y'all. Uh, ooh, I don't even want to drop, bro. I'll drop like four videos today. Oh, I don't know if I should drop four. I might just drop one. I'll wait till like tomorrow and drop one. I'm trying to get content out to y'all, like good content too. But how y'all doing, man? I'm going to wait for some more, like a decent amount of people to get in here before we try to, the, you know, the Q&A session. Welcome to the live. How's everyone's day been? Yeah. I'm good, my brother. I'm good, my brother. May God bless you, man. God bless you too, bro. Yeah, man. So we we're gonna do a do a do a do a session tonight. So um, whatever questions y'all may have, it doesn't even have to just be. Hi, bro. Grace and peace in Jesus' name. Amen, man. Yes, sir. Hey, if y'all have not even just like, it don't even have to just be like Christian or biblical, like biblically. Like it can be any type of questions for real. So like. Let's just like have a combo for real. It's 11.15 p.m. here in Brazil. Oh, dang, I got people in Brazil. Oh, snap. Shout out to Brazil. Shout out to Brazil. That's crazy. 11.15, yeah, it's 8.15 here. I'm in the US. Caleb Knight Ministries. What's good, Caleb? What's up? Wait, Caleb Knight. Is that, oh wait, is that, is that the Caleb I know? I'm trying to see. Caleb, Caleb Knight. I'm trying to see if that's, if that's if I know him. But welcome, man. Um, eleven fifteen. Yeah, bro, in Brazil, I guess. How's it going with life, man? Life, hey, man. Life, life's life's good, bro. Life, life's. I'm blessed for real. This year, I have, I have something special for this channel, bro. I, I see growth. I can see something special in the, just this year overall, though. Like, I can just see something special in this year. Um, with school and, you know, college and everything that's starting for me this upcoming semester. So, yeah, this year's going to be good. It's already going good. So, grace and peace, everyone. Hi, hey, how's everyone doing, though, mentally? How's everyone doing mentally? This is a mental check in. God bless you out in Brazil. Yeah, man, I've never been to Brazil. I always like I haven't really been outside of the the states. So, hey, man, the amazing I feel it too for both of us. Man, yeah, y'all. Okay, I'm a, I'm gonna put y'all on to my Discord. My Discord, I need to repost it again on my uh, community page. But um, y'all need to follow me on Instagram too because I like to post the Discord stuff. Hey, man, you got an idea? I can do a devotional about I'm doing one at my church next week. By the way. Mentally, I'm good. Wait, hey man, you got an idea? I can do devotional. Yeah, bro. Hold on. Hey man, you got any... Devotional, like, are you doing one at your church? Or you want to do one on the live? I need to make it to where, like, I can have people join. I never step out of my state to 
RJ is quite big. RJ, what's RJ? Is RJ like the state? Like, we're well not the state, but like, so you got the country of Brazil, you got Brazil, and then what? Well, what's the state like? That's like the part of Brazil, but I ain't never been outside the country, bro. Real? Oh, okay, okay. My bad, y'all. I'm kind of slow. Yeah, it's at a church. Okay, wait. What church? What uh? What state? I don't even know if y'all know what state I'm in. I've never even told y'all what state I'm in, but I'm in Texas. Yeah, but yeah, man, life's good, man. Just just grinding and locked in and trying to trying to just grow every day. Louisiana, Texas sounds nice. Yeah. Texas, it's cool. It's cool out here. Dallas area is cool out here. The only thing is, like, I mean, that's what everywhere you gotta watch where you go for real, but, you know, it's not so bad here at all. I definitely enjoy it. Bro, so I thought about something. I'm doing good mentally, bro. Appreciate you asking how are you mentally. Mentally, I'm doing way better now. Um, I'll tell y'all this, like, last year, terrible. Year before that, terrible. Kind of, well, not terrible, up and down. Do y'all go to the gym? If I can ask anything, I want to know. Yeah, so I, I go to the gym. I hoop, but I, I do lift weights. I do, I squat, I do, I do all that. I lift. I don't post, I don't be posting my lifts and stuff on here. But maybe, maybe that's looking an idea I might go for. Maybe I'll start doing some self-improvement stuff. And just, you know, I'm not a big self-improvement. Like, I'm all for self-improvement, but like, I don't know, I feel like self-improvement is like, you should just always want to do that. It shouldn't just be something you start doing. Um, you doing great, brother. Yes, sir. I appreciate it. Yeah, I pre bro, that's crazy. That, that prayer video got like almost 7,000 views. That's insane. And then I think the video, my other video has like 600 views, but that's like so good. You looking buff. I mean, bro, I ain't really, bro, I lost like 10 pounds. <laughs> so look, right? So I was like 170 pounds. And then I lost like, I stopped eating as much for some reason. We just didn't have like food like that. So I stopped really eating like that. So now I have like, I'm like 160. I wanted to keep the weight on, but it's hard. Yeah, me too. All hopes in this year. I believe it's going to be a boy. Yeah, I need, look, I can't, look, I can't take two straight losses. Also, y'all follow me on Instagram at Draco Sway if you haven't, because sometimes I like I just post the videos. Y'all might, and if y'all don't have the notification bell on, y'all may not get it. But on Instagram, I usually re, I usually post the links on my videos and stuff on there. So if y'all follow me at Draco Sway on Instagram, um, and I'm gonna follow y'all back. I'm gonna follow each and every one of y'all back. I'm not gonna be one of them dudes where I ain't gonna follow you back. Um, you're right, haha. We should do self improvement all over, but I think we don't usually have the cult this culture around the world. Yeah, we don't, cause we're abnormal. Like the world sees us as abnormal. So like, what's not normal to the world is doing what's right, and Christianity is not. The world doesn't see that as normal. So, you know, I feel like just like I don't know when you're just you. And just be your authentic self. I feel like it, it doesn't matter. Unless you're like, your authentic self is a, a madman. <laughs> on some uh, on some crazy stuff. But, um, yeah, I'm saying like, dude, we need, what I'm trying to say is. Are you going to be making a video on your street preaching? That's not a bad idea. I might have to think about that one. Uh, are you pursuing... Hold on. Dang, y'all got some questions flowing in. Okay, are you pursuing further into college or anything? Yeah, so I'm going to co probably I'm going to community college and I'm gonna be taking some classes. Um, just I'm gonna get the basics out the way. Then I'm I'm probably gonna work a job till I get this channel to really get to that level, like monetize growth like crazy. Whenever I whenever I get that channel to that level, then I can do this. Like I'm making good money, I'm making really good money from this. Then I I can obviously I can put more into the channel. But then also I can, you know, expand and do this more. So um, that's the hope. I hope and pray for it. But, you know, 
I gotta I gotta make good content. Get you know get y'all get y'all minds right. Get my mind right. So that's the hope. But I'm gonna end up getting a job or something probably. Um, love your content. Keep up the faith in Jesus Christ, man. I appreciate it, man. I take some. I take time. All right. Look, I even show y'all like I show y'all my journal. Bro, my bad, y'all. My my dad was texting. Me. But look, I'll even show y'all like. So like y'all see right here, I literally like take my time. I literally write notes down. Like, and I write, I do like I, I study, I do my research and stuff. And if there's a certain time when God answers your prayers, like literally I don't write it all down. Like me, I know it's slang, but in my opinion, I really look like a, a shrimp. LOL, my posture was terrible. A shrimp, what's a shrimp? Shrimp? Hey, yo. No, I'm playing. But in some... Yes? I'm on, I'm on live. Um... But, uh... In some week, training in gym. And I got it really better. You have a diary? Oh, that's not a diary, bro. Just a journal, bro. Calm down. Ain't no dear diary stuff over here. I wrote, I wrote wrong. Sorry. Yeah. No. I just, I, I write everything down, and then whatever I'm gonna study, whatever I'm talking about in, in in the video, that's what I usually put together. So it's premeditated on what I'm gonna say, but at the same time, I think about it. Here's a common atheist question: If God is all powerful, why does He allow evil to happen? So why does He allow evil to happen? Well, He one. Sin wasn't created by God. Two, the evil is Satan. Three, sometimes God doesn't God allow certain situations to teach people and to show people things, right? Um, now you you see what happened to oh who was that? Was that Abraham? I think that was Abraham. I can't think. I believe it was Abraham though, and his son, right? So. God was telling him to bring his son, right, as a offering, right? God, obviously, he obviously he didn't end up going through. But even that example right there, I mean, God allows certain things to teach people lessons. And you see what's happening, all the evil. So, I mean, that I think that's the, the thing with how people think. It's like, oh, there's no God. If, there was, if, if God is so good and he's above Satan, then why is all this bad stuff happening? Like, there's a reason. You approve that Steph Curry jump shot? You ever do no leg jumpers on the court? <laughs> of course. Bro, I, I don't even be, I don't be hooping like that. Like, I be, I hooped like a couple days ago, but that's about it. I need to like, I'm gonna put y'all, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do something separate from like life advice and like biblical content. I'm gonna do like a workout video. I'm gonna do that for y'all, cause I'm gonna show y'all some more. Dude, I heard really run. I heard diary when I was writing, but I think the idea of the journal is important. Always good to have it written. Yeah, I remember stuff better when I write it down. Me personally, writing stuff. My bad. Writing stuff down for me, it allows me to remember it better. It's like I can't just look at something once and then like get it. Like I just I've just never been like that. But like I can I can if I write it down, that's like writing oh how do you spell uh aerodactyl or something? And you write A E R O, you know, D A C T Y L, if that's how you spell it. But you write it down multiple times, multiple times, then you don't know how to spell it. Easy. But um I won't be on I'll be on live till till 20 minute mark so um because i got some i got a video i gotta edit for y'all so um but i won't post it till tomorrow so y'all look out for that anybody else which i got which i got going want us to pray for you yes i always need them bro i always need prayers always
I should do it once I f once I found a logical sequence to prove God since the Twilight bus trap and I didn't hold on hold on hold on hold on hold on, hold on. I gotta reread that I should do it once I found a logical sequence to prove God's existence well there's a lot of things there's a lot of things to prove God's existence how was the world made there you go what's up man what's up David how you doing David Welcome to the stream. How's the weather in Texas? It's not. It's not. It's not overly cold. It's. It's actually. It's decent right now. It's not like you go to like the East Coast. The East Coast is mad. It's cold all the time. You all know that Mickey Mouse is public domain now. Wait, what? What does that mean? What does that? What does that mean? Mickey Mouse. I'm lost, y'all. You're gonna have to tell me about that one. I'm gonna do something with my hair though. I gotta do something with it, bro. I don't know what to do with it. I don't know what to do with it. I don't want I don't think I want dreads though. Do I, I don't know if I want dreads. But um I got one viewer in here. I'm gonna go for a little bit more. It's just right, I wanted to share with someone I just discovered. Oh, for sure. Mine's pretty good, it's not bad. Yeah, I'll be trying to make sure I'm, I'm up there with my style and stuff. But, um, dang, why did my numbers just drop from one to six? Welcome, welcome to the stream. Where are you in Texas? Dallas area. Um, it's just right I want to share with someone I just discovered. So the, you talking about the Mickey Mouse? Look at James chapter one, verse thirteen through fifteen. It, it will tell you why sin is. God bless you. Man, which church do you go to? Um I go to Dang, I can't even think right now. Tri City Church of Christ. Um, have you thought about doing a men's fashion style? Okay, so this is the thing about me, right? I got my own little fashion sense. I ain't no fashionista. I ain't got, like, no top tier stuff, but I just, like, I rock whatever. Whatever I look good in, I rock. So, like, I look good in, like, black. I look good, I look good in, like, let me think. Like, like, sweaters, like, pullovers, jackets, like, jacket. Like, say, like, for church, I wear, like, like, maybe a, um... A button down, like a short button down, kind of open. Not showing my chest, but like then like some dress slacks, dress shoes. Like that's that's my kind of my kind of style. Um, guys just jumped in a lot. I know. That mother said that said zero. Then it jumped all the way to seven. I know you're probably going, you know going to your other YouTubers that y'all love, but you know. Once I start branching out into a bunch of different avenues. Maybe I might get into the gaming. We'll see. We'll see about that. I don't know about the gaming yet, though. But as far as my fashion sense, though, fashion sense is 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 different for everybody, for sure. Everybody got different body. Everybody got different body types. Everybody got different, you know, minds of what they what they look good in. I'll stay for another ten minutes. Yeah, I'll probably be on for a little bit more. So you're good. Definitely the same thing I do. I keep it casual. I haven't gotten to the suits as of yet. Yeah, bro, you need to. Bro, I, be, I look good with a suit on. Um, not gonna lie, I like streetwear. Yeah, streetwear, um, I need to invest in some more whenever I get the money for it. I'm still trying to find a style for me that I like something more conservator? Conservative? You got swag though, right? You know I know. I mean, it's something slight. I, I, I ain't got the most, I, I think I got swag, but you know. If I think I got swag, I got swag. I ain't wearing no corny outfit now. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. I ain't wearing no corny outfit. Um, I'll stay on till like, depending on how many people are in here, I'll stay on till like 8.30, like 38 or something. I'll stay like six more minutes. I'll stay on this point. I gotta, I gotta edit. Um, Brazil, we use the word conservador. I think it's the way it is in English. Also, like, 
conservative is that how you say it okay so what is your stance on praying and speaking in tongues um i need to like look i need to research about that because i was at this one i went to this one church event at this like different kind of it's it's like a gathering for like young adults or whatever and they when they were praying they were speaking in tongues i was just i was a little lost but i may i have to do some research on that um i have to read biblically for that really because i don't really i know what the bible talks about speaking in tongues but I, I gotta i gotta read about it um has anyone started doing a bible reading plan um honestly what i do is if i find a book chapter verse i'm gonna go i'm gonna turn to it and i'm gonna stick with it and then um i'm gonna keep reading like like maybe a chapter or some verses in that in that chapter and then like write down the different parts of the verse and then what I think it means or what I believe it means and all that. That's how I do it. How do you speak in tongues? I have no clue. I could not tell you. If I had the answer, I would tell you, but I don't know how to do that and I've only seen like a couple people do it and I, I don't understand it. I have to look it up. I'm just going to be honest with y'all. I don't know what it means. If any of y'all knows what it means, y'all tell me because that's a good Bible reading plan. Yeah. I try to just like stick with it, honestly. I stick with that and then, I mean, it's helped, it's helped me. So I'm going to do whatever is going to help my growth. Light flex. I've had the experience of being filled with the Holy Ghost. Yeah, I feel like if you if you end up coming to God, you do it for the right reason. Can I set my opinion here? I can be wrong, but till I understand that speaking in tongues is to speak in different languages. Like there were people of all nationalities. Oh yeah, there was. Um, hold on. Can I? I can be wrong, but till I understand the speaking in tongues, it's to speak in different languages. Uh I, I gotta do some more research on that. But whenever I was like listening to a person speaking in tongues, yeah, they were saying like, I think it sounded like different languages. I was just a little lost. I didn't know what was going on. So I was kind of like scratching my head. Like ancient Hebrew. Yeah, I don't know. I gotta, I gotta do my research on that. I know about a, a verse in the Bible that talks about how like, how like, um, there was a nation and everyone was speaking or God made it to where no one understood each other and um, basically everyone spoke different languages. I forgot what, uh, I can't even think right now. It's like everybody was speaking in different languages and stuff like that. I gotta, yeah, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta look up that tongues, bro. That, I don't know, bro. I gotta look that one up. <laughs> Cause, ooh, boy, rusty. Imagine if I start talking like this. Your T boy, hey, ooh, yeah, you got that one, bro. Woo, you got that one, bro. I don't really have a stance on speaking in tongues. If you wanna say your prayer in a different language, then hey, and you understand? Yeah, monkey, you got that one, bro. <laughs> you got that one. <laughs> You got that one, bro. I don't know that one. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be on here for like another minute. Then I'm gonna hop off here. No, I, I don't see. And that's the thing. Like, you can say in a prayer and it's in a different language. Ain't nothing wrong with that. It's, it's still praying. As long as you're talking to God, that's what it's about. It would really be a. It would really be a miracle. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Um, favorite Bible verse? I like, um, hold on. You got things to many languages of today or something. Master Kamachi dropped a good one. Yeah, I feel like a uh, favorite verse. I don't know if I have a favorite verse, but it's, um, I can do all things through Christ that strengthens me. I like that one. I don't really have a set on verse. 
like I have a lot of verses I like to read, but um, whatever it's about um, coming to God about my problems, I like that verse. I can't I can't think of it right now. It's not on top of my head, but um, and I like God is love. That's my that's probably my go-to because that's in my that's in my Instagram bio. Um, but that's my favorite favorite verse. My grandma used to like tell me that all the time, like God is love, and that that's just a verse that stuck with me. So, yeah. After you receive the Holy Ghost, you receive proud to be a witness to this world. Something like that. But um, I appreciate y'all for tuning into the live. Um, more videos coming out. Um, I gotta edit this video for y'all. Also, follow me on Instagram if you haven't. Draco Sway, D R A C O S W A Y. I'm gonna follow each and every one of you back. And yeah. I will catch y'all in the next one. And oh yeah, also my bad, my bad. Follow follow the Discord also. I will put the Discord in a community post. So y'all y'all look out for that. But um appreciate y'all watching. Now I have to go to bed, it's eleven thirty eight. This is for the talk, guys. Have a good sleep. You too, bro. Mine, Isaiah 40, verse 8. The grass withereth, the flower fadeth, but the word of our God shall stand forever. Oh, yeah, I like that one. Isaiah 40, verse 8. I like that one. I like Psalms um, 144. I like Psalms 144. Like, thy rod, thy staff, they come for me. I, I, like, I like that one. I like that verse. That thy rock and thy staff they come for me. I like I like that one. But um I'm gonna catch y'all. I appreciate y'all watching. Peace.